Baby Steps. I'm Brittany. And I'm Corey, and today we're gonna to talk to you about our registry. That's right, our registry was <laughs> a lot of fun, but it was also a little overwhelming. It was pretty scary seeing a list of all the things that we need. It's not just, you know, diapers and a crib. No, <laughs> like you thought it was. Um, no, it's a lot more than diapers in a crib. And luckily, we got a lot of things passed down to us from my brother and sister-in-law, Colin and Katie, from the first season of Baby Steps. Yeah, we've been really lucky with a lot of our friends that have already had kids and and swear off ever having any more. So. <laughs> That's right. Some of the stuff that we needed, we got. Uh, we actually have already had our baby shower, which was so much fun. And if you'd like to see that, you can go check that out on our channel. It's the Southern Fried Maple Leafs. Before our baby shower, of course, we registered. And one of the places <laughs> that we went was Bye Bye Baby. That's right. We spent probably about three hours, uh, you know, click, 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 <laughs> on everything in the store. <laughs> That's right, we spent a lot of time beeping and going through a little book. If you've never done a registry before, they give you uh, this little book and it tells you all the things that you need and you can go through and check off everything that you have mm -hmm. registered for. Yeah, it was a really fun process. It was a fun process. Some of the things that we got from our registry we're really excited about. Like we got the bassinet that we really wanted uh -huh. because it swivels to us and so we can be laying in bed and just swivel the baby over to us and she can sleep right there next to us in the bed. We also were lucky enough to get a car seat. We spent a lot of time looking at car seats. So many car seats. Nailed it. Look, it's got the hands and everything. It's walking around trying them all out, trying to press all the little buttons and gadgets, trying to get it in and out of the, you know, the car seat holder to the little carrying thing. And um, it was pretty overwhelming. There was about 10,000 car seats to choose from. <laughs> there was a lot of car seats. I was very surprised at how heavy they were. It was pretty heavy. It'll be a good arm workout. That's We were sure. lucky enough to get a car seat at the baby shower and uh, we're real thankful for that. Yes, our mom, Granberry, got us the car seat and uh, we love the one that she picked out for us. It's it's not the one that we actually registered for, but it's one that's even better than that. So she went above and beyond and we love her. Mm -hmm. And I'm really excited to install that sucker in the Van Brigini. Oh yeah. We were actually lucky enough to get the Gritty Co swing a jiggy handed down for us from Colin and Katie, so thank you. Uh, it looks super comfortable and I'm sure Sophia will love it and be rocked to sleep many a night. Many a night. <laughs> Let's only hope all this stuff works. Uh, we got so many amazing things from our friends and family that were off our registry, and but we also have a lot of things that we didn't get from our registry. I think we registered for what, like 130 something items? Who knew a baby needed so much stuff? <laughs> It's crazy. We thought, yeah, diapers were going to be our main thing, but there's a lot of stuff that we didn't think about mm -hmm. that now we know. Like, we got baby bath stuff. We got um, a lot of cute little clothes for mm -hmm. her. We got a lot of good stuff from all, from everybody, and it was it's awesome that people can come together and, and help you out because it is a big expense. Some of the things we didn't register for was a crib and a changing table because I'm making that myself. I'm really excited to be building this crib because it's going to have a lot of cool features and a couple little surprises for Sophia. It's nice to have a handy <laughs> husband. Yes, he is making a lot of our furniture for us. I think we're gonna need more than the crib and the changing table. Mm -hmm. um, I wanted to have like some chest of drawers and right now y'all, the nursery is a mess. After Christmas, after the holidays, we'll really get in there and get her nursery ready to go. And so everything will be ready for when she comes home. One thing we didn't register for and haven't got it was the mattress because we wanna do our due diligence <laughs> and research to make sure we get something that's hypoallergenic, comfortable, and good for our little princess. Yes, we definitely wanna make sure that the mattress that she's sleeping on is gonna be safe. We don't want any chemicals and things like that, and it's gotta be waterproof, of course. And <laughs> so we just wanna do a little bit more research on things like the mattress and some other big items that we know we'll need. Um, but as far as the registry itself, it was definitely a process. Mm -hmm. It took a lot longer than I thought it was going to take. And mm -hmm. for me, being pregnant Wait. and just tired already, it was, <laughs> it was definitely a, one of the harder tasks we've had to do. I'm so glad that we got it done though, because now not only do we have a registry, we basically also have a shopping list. Mm -hmm. Everything that we didn't get on the registry at the baby shower or that we're not going to get from now until the time that she's born, we know all the things that we need and we can just go pick them up ourselves. It does, it makes it very handy having a printout with all the things that you're missing. That's right. Thank y'all so much for watching this episode of Baby Steps. 
Tell us in the comments about your registry and what you put on yours. If you haven't done it already, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. That's right, and make sure to tune in next time for our next episode of Baby Steps. We can't wait to see y'all, and have a great Christmas. Bye!